Clark County schools and a principal are now the target of a federal lawsuit. Now, it claims administrators did not properly investigate a bullying incident despite being required to under law. The alleged incident happening at Gerheim Elementary School just last week. We reported how the principal at that very same school was accused by police of attempting to cover up misconduct during a separate child abuse investigation. Joshua Pagaro joining us now live in our newsroom to explain. Joshua. In this federal lawsuit you see here, Michelle Cox, a former teacher at Gerheim Elementary, says she followed protocol to report the bullying of her own child. But when nothing was done, she reported to the state, and for that she claims she was retaliated against. In Cox's lawsuit, she says her child was subjected to bullying at Gerheim during the 2018-19 school year, to the point where another student told her child, quote, when I am older, I'm going to murder somebody, somebody like you. The administration, in, in our view, dropped the ball and allowed the student to continue to be harassed and bullied. Jason Bach is Cox's lawyer in this federal lawsuit. Ryan Lewis, the principal at Gerheim at the time, is accused of not only failing to investigate the bullying, but also of suppressing reports pertaining to any bullying incidents. She was retaliated against and uh, accused of wrongdoing for essentially for raising her voice or questioning the principal. Cox says when Gerheim administrators failed to investigate the bullying, she reported it to the state hotline Safe Voice. According to the lawsuit, that became the first official report on filed since the school never filed one, although it's CCSD policy. It goes on to say administrators looked into the matter and determined Cox's allegation was unsubstantiated. But when an associate superintendent took over the case, she disagreed. She accused Gerheim administrators of not doing an adequate investigation and not following protocol. Additionally, neither the students nor the parents involved were interviewed by administrators, which is a requirement. District leaders accused Gerheim's principal of creating a climate that allows bullying. They had not conducted the investigation that they said that they had conducted, and, uh, and she recommended that certain action take place at that school. And it's our understanding uh, that no action took place. Now, Michelle Cox is no longer employed at the school, according to the lawsuit. She was asked not to return from leave. Ryan Lewis, the principal, is no longer at the school either. CCSD confirming he's been assigned to other duties. Reporting live in the newsroom, Joshua Piguero, 8 News Now.